Hello everyone, good morning. Aaron Bent, aka Magic Man Crypto here. Hopefully everyone had a good night and slept pretty well. I had a couple sales just to update you on my profit trailer. I had eight sales when I went to bed, now I have uh, 13. So that's always a good thing to wake up to. Um, I also have a couple ba DCA bags here. Uh, not too bad. I got f this I'm going to be working on for the rest of the day. So this is not bad. Um, let's see if it if it can at least sustain itself and, and go uh, further positive. The topic of this video is going to be about PT Magic installation. So heading right over, you'll come over to this website. It's called uh, HTTPS semicolon github.com. Uh, the maker's name, which is uh, Led Ledrick. Anyways, I'm gonna have the link in the description. So, just click on the link in the description below, and then you'll be able to get to this page. So, what we're going to do is back up your profit trailer directory. All right. So, if we want to back up our profit trailer directory, basically, to make things easier, just hit copy in the same in the same directory so we're on the desktop here right let me actually go to my desktop so it's easier so hit copy hit paste it's gonna add it's gonna have a copy all right we can leave it as copy keep it simple that, that's basically how you can uh back up your your profit trailer folder and your files so just in case if something goes wrong um anyways long story short Click on this link uh, to, to download the Windows Server hosting. Um, I personally did this on my tablet or my Surface tablet, and it did not, uh, I didn't uh, need to do this. But then, of course, I already had this from trying to install uh, Profit Trailer. So, which one here? It says current runtime version 2.05 so we're going to look for current runtime version 2.05 it was where a windows server hosting exe click on that uh not right now i'm going to click save no thanks i'm going to run it just in case i need it because i am doing this on my desktop so i'm going to go through this uh, just for the installation purposes. So I'm going to run this actually on my desktop. Actually, I need to close it off of my... Um, I need to stop running it on my... on my tablet so I don't run into any issues. Yes. Selection successfully completed. All right, so we can close this page out. We will down. We will then move on to the next thing. S uh, start the setup and follow the instructions. Download the latest zip of PT Magic. So you, you can right click here, open link, and new tab. You'll have it right here. Releases, which he has a new release, and I'm interested to see what's going on with this. I'm gonna have to update my um, PT Magic on my tablet as well. So. Uh, we're going to unzip file to a location you want to use PT Magic. All right, so actually, so I can make this easier. PT Magic. I'm going to extract to PT Magic 1.03. I like to extract to a folder just in case, like, it spits out a thousand files <laughs> on your desktop. It wouldn't, it wouldn't look clean. So. I always, just to be sure or safe, um, I unzip files to a folder, a new folder. So, um, all right. So now that we have this open, we're going to have this. Open up your profit trailer, I believe. I think this is what's going to be coming up next. All right, so we have both of those open. Then it says, copy all files and the folder monitor located in default settings to PT Magic. All right, so 
Key magic. And now, what does this say? Copy all files in the folder monitor called default, uh, located in default settings to PT magic. So, monitor everything here. We're going to copy. Copy in the folder located in default to PT magic. So, I believe we're going to paste it here. All right. So that is done. Copy your pairs, DCA properties, and indicators properties from your profit trailer trading directory to presets uh, slash default folder in PT Magic. All right. So we will go here. Go here. Copy. We will then look for presets default. Presets default. Paste. So you should see the three files here. Alrighty. Your applications.properties file to profit trailer and change uh, the variable trading log history to something high like 999. $9 you can do that. Uh, that's just something extra, I believe. But um, just for this purposes, I will do that and just, sorry about that little hiccup. I had to remove um, my API keys and stuff like that from the video uh, just for security purposes. I had my password and stuff like that in there. So this is where in the document it is telling you, see where it says um, application properties file to change the variable trading.log history to something like 999. Uh, it is right here trading log history you can change this to one two three four then you would hit save I won't be showing you guys that because my API keys is in there so hopefully you guys I mean that's not necessary anyway to run this um, open settings dot general dot Jason with a text editor and adjust the settings to your needs hint double check the settings for profit trailer path and exchange as if they are not correct, you will run into issues. So profit trailer path and exchange. So let's go to settings.general uh, JSON. So let's check the PT, uh, PT magic folder. Let's go back. We're going to go to PT magic. And it's going to be settings.general JSON, which I believe is here. So we're going to open that file. Now, it is basically telling you to make sure that your profit trailer path is correct. So, your profit trailer path. All right. Um, so, our profit trailer path is going to be, see, obviously do not copy this, um, do not copy what I'm typing because it's going to be different on your computer. And actually, let me show you an easier way to do this. Uh, so, profit trailer path to your trading path and exchange okay so if I remember correctly all right I'm gonna do this but I don't think I'm supposed to be including the trade excuse me the trading folder so just double click up here or click up here and then you can copy and paste this directory so you don't have to type it or figure it out or anything like that you go to folder path and you hit um, control V or paste. Okay. Uh, so then you'll have to go in here and hit uh, and insert that double. Uh, I believe this is a backslash. If anybody can correct me, I always get them mixed up for it and backslash. Um, but I believe this one's a backslash. But if anyone is smarter than I am, please uh, let me know. And let me just verify shortly. Uh, just so we don't have to run into any issues what it is because I have it running on my uh, on my tablet so I'm just gonna double check give me a second here just so we don't have to go back and forth um, uh, settings general okay the trading folder is not needed the trading folder is not needed okay and then then you would type in the exchange that you're working with 
which in my case it is going to be Binance. Uh, start balance. I believe this this works with um, this works with um, BTC, but I'm gonna take a chance and hopefully they fix it for Ethereum. So in this new uh, update. So, all right. Then it says important. It says please check that you use double backslashes in the path not single backslashes so they are backslashes otherwise you get the following error so this is the error you get if you inputted the wrong uh path open settings.analyzer.json with this with a text editor and adjust the settings to your needs okay so this is where i think um your settings would go here you're you're basically how you would want um pt magic to modify your settings um, in here, I'm going to leave it as default. This is just a video about the installation and getting this running. And it looks fine to me. Um, open monitor forward slash app settings dot Jason with it and, uh, and adjust the PT magic base path to your PT magic root directory. This is necessary for the monitor to get the data from the PT magic bot. All right, this is where um, I did have a little issues. So hopefully I remember. So, okay, let's go to monitor app settings. And then I have to put in the PT magic path, which this is what we'll do, uh, everyone. We will, I believe this is the root. Is this considered the root? Let me double check on my working platform shortly here and I'll get an answer just because I do not want to have to go back and forth. All right, so PT Magic is in here. Is it twice? Oh, it's three times. Okay, so it's here. We're going to copy this. So do the same thing. Uh, click up here. You can hit control A to select all, hit control C to copy. You'll go over here, select this, hit control V to paste. Um, then you'll insert your double backslashes or else this will not work. Let's insert our double backslashes. I'm going to just go through. And I'll show you in a bigger uh, here and for everyone that's watching this is not the slasher that you're supposed to be putting in <laughs> it is the opposite all right so they have an example right here as well so all right so we're gonna save this file control s or you click file and then hit save all right we can close this out then it says run PT magic and wait for it uh, it to complete its first run. All right, so we're ready to get this up and running. So let's see. We are going to start here. So start PT Magic. Double click this, and let's see if we can watch magic. Okay, so it says profit trailer directory not found. Your profit trailer path. So I have the wrong profit trailer path. All right. Uh, where was that? So profit trailer path. Profit trailer path is in the settings that general. Okay. Settings that general. Settings that general. What? I thought I put it here. Okay. Um, so I guess I did not put it here for settings that general how did it get oh i probably didn't save it huh dummy you do not need trading by the way you do not need trading so i guess we'll just be going over this again as you can see i i ran into the issue so you never know um if one of you forgot to hit the save the control save button like i did finance Binance. 
So we'll hit Control S or hit Save this time. I'm gonna actually double check and make sure it's saved because I don't wanna come back. Okay, so it's saved. Now we're ready. Start PT Magic, up and running. It looks like it's clean. Then um, once this comes up clean, start uh, the PT Magic monitor to get the GUI. I don't even have um, I don't even have Profit Trailer running right now. Uh, so I'm gonna get Profit Trailer up and running. Um, let's see if it works in this platform. Let's see if it works. I'm just gonna get everything running and, and then hopefully everyone will be able to see how it looks when it's running. Uh, so, turn root path, no worries, I'm still alive. So this is basically gathering the information from the markets. Uh, as you can see, it's got the current um, Ethereum price. This may take, this may take a little bit longer than, than um, everything else, but once it's up and running, this thing runs faster than I expected, way faster than I expected. Um, so uh, let's see if I can pull it up. See if I can pull it up. Um, this would be local host 5000. Yeah, it's probably not running yet. <laughs> Could not find uh, PT Magic, PT Magic. Slash data last runtime summary JSON. Let me just double check here. I don't think it's it's writing any files here. That's why it's not showing up. Uh, data. Yeah, it's not it's not finished writing the files yet. And um, yeah, sorry, I I didn't want to go through a a long installation process. Uh, so I'll probably fast forward this part just so we're not sitting here staring at my screen and my face. So I'll probably see you in about five minutes, I would say. But I'm just going to keep this running and then I'll have it. Oh, Already back. Um, it may not take five minutes. It may take a little bit more, maybe 20 uh, to 30 minutes. Uh, so I am just starting up my profit trailer again. I'm going to start up, uh, PT magic just so everyone can see it and how it's supposed to look when it loads up. And then once you start this up, you can also get started, uh, start PT magic monitor. Make sure that's running. This is clean. This looks clean. And this is my exchange spitting out invalidated. So I am going to go over to my profit trailer. Check it out. It's running. Then you'll type in local host semicolon 5,000 or port 5,000, I should say. And then you hit enter and then this will, this will come up. And you can go through and look at the look at PT Magic. There you go. Uh, if anyone has any questions, you can uh, find me in the Discord chat that I have a link below. Uh, please use it if you need any help. Once again, uh, happy profits. If you guys are interested in the Brave browser, I have a link for that as well. That will help earn you guys free bat tokens monthly and also help me as well as um, a Brave uh, publisher. So with that being said, hopefully everyone enjoyed the installation guide. Hopefully this was helpful and let me know if you guys have any problems. Have a good one. Aaron Bent. AKA Magic Man Crypto. See ya.